call it the Buddha nature, the Christ nature. It's the self that's, that's changeless, perfect innocence, pure spirit. And the Holy Spirit is, is like your intuitive inner voice, the bridge back to that higher self in Christian terminology. So it's like the Holy Spirit uses the symbols of the dream world to guide you step by step, like through the labyrinth or through the maze, to help you reach a point where you can let go of the ego self and merge and recognize yourself as the higher self, which is what the Greeks always taught, know thyself. And they were talking about the, the true self or the higher self. So really, the whole journey is about learning to be, tune in, be very intuitive, listen to that small, still inner voice guide you step by step so that you can recognize the higher self. And for some people, they just like the idea of, of their higher self speaking to them. It's the, it's the real self speaking and communicating with them through egoic symbols like dreams, dream symbols, words, signs, symbols. You can hear it through songs and music, poetry, people you meet on the street or friends, relatives, you know, angels, visions, you know, it comes in many, many different forms, but, but you might say that higher self or the Holy Spirit uh, is the representation of that higher self, helping you come back and remember that, that self. Okay. Okay, now what I thought we would do is show a clip here uh, from Way of the Peaceful Warrior. There was one that came called Spiritual Pride. Could we have it turned, turned up for it to go? I think what we can do is we can turn that um, light. Oh, very nice. And there's one, one more light over there we thought we can get. Uh -oh. Did I do it? Uh -oh. Yeah, it just takes a while now. We got a little free time. Undoing spiritual pride. Are you kidding me? This isn't another vision, is it? I don't see how this can be happening. What the hell are you doing? Dan and his teacher, Socrates. Something wrong? We don't do this anymore, remember? We know better. We're better than everyone who doesn't know what we know, but the way we do. Is that what you mean? Not better, maybe. Smarter. There is no better. Could have taught you trust me. You done flattering yourself? You chose me. Why should I believe you? You taught me yourself to only listen to my own intuition. How do you know that I'm not your own intuition speaking to you right now? You mean maybe I made you up? Don't mess with me like that.